The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. In the diagram shown, we have a circle with a center at point O. Therefore, we call this figure Circle O. Notice the symbol we use for a circle is a circle with a dot in the middle. We can see that segment OA is a radius of the circle because it represents the distance from a point on the circle to the center. Another way of defining a radius is a segment that joins the center of the circle to a point on the circle. Now let's go through some other vocabulary words associated with circles. Segment FG is called a chord. Can you think of how we would define a chord? Pause the audio for a moment and see if you can come up with a definition. A chord is a segment whose endpoints lie on the circle. Segment EB is called a diameter of the circle. Can you think of how we would define a diameter? Pause the audio for a moment and see if you can come up with a definition. A diameter is a chord that contains the center of the circle. Line DC is called a secant. Can you think of how we would define a secant? Pause the audio for a moment and see if you can come up with a definition. A secant is a line that contains a chord or a line that intersects the circle at two points.